The Reasons for the Destruction of Pompeii Introduction The city of Pompeii stands as a haunting reminder of the capriciousness of nature and the fragility of human existence. Frozen in time by the catastrophic eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD, Pompeii's ruins have captivated historians, archaeologists, and tourists alike for centuries. However, the question of what exactly caused the destruction of Pompeii remains a subject of intense scrutiny and debate. In this exploration, we delve into the multifaceted reasons behind the demise of this ancient Roman city. Geographical context Pompeii was located in the region of Campania, near the Bay of Naples in Italy. Positioned at the foot of Mount Vesuvius, an active stratovolcano, the city enjoyed fertile soil and a strategic trading location. However, this proximity to the volcano would ultimately prove to be both a boon and a curse for Pompeii. Volcanic activity. The primary catalyst for the destruction of Pompeii was undoubtedly the violent eruption of Mount Vesuvius. On the fateful day of August 24, 79 AD, Vesuvius unleashed its fury in a series of cataclysmic eruptions that blanketed the surrounding area in ash, pumice, and volcanic debris. The eruption was so powerful that it ejected a colossal column of ash and gas miles into the sky, casting a shadow over Pompeii and its neighboring settlements. Pyroclastic Flows one of the most devastating aspects of the eruption was the generation of pyroclastic flows, fast-moving clouds of hot gas, ash, and rock fragments that surged down the slopes of Vesuvius at incredible speeds. These deadly flows engulfed Pompeii and nearby Herculaneum, instantly vaporizing organic matter and burying the cities under layers of volcanic material. The sheer force and temperature of the pyroclastic flows left little chance of survival for the inhabitants of Pompeii, sealing their fate in an instant. Ashfall and Roof Collapse In addition to pyroclastic flows, Pompeii was inundated with heavy ashfall during the eruption. The weight of the accumulating ash placed immense stress on the roofs of buildings throughout the city, causing many of them to collapse under the immense pressure. This further compounded the chaos and destruction, trapping individuals beneath the rubble and adding to the death toll, lack of preparedness. While the eruption of Mount Vesuvius was undoubtedly a natural disaster of unparalleled magnitude, the destruction of Pompeii was exacerbated by a lack of preparedness and warning systems. In the decades leading up to the eruption, there were signs of increasing volcanic activity around Vesuvius, including earthquakes and minor eruptions. However, the Roman authorities and inhabitants of Pompeii were ill-equipped to interpret these warning signs or implement effective evacuation measures. Cultural Factors Beyond the geological and environmental factors, the destruction of Pompeii was also influenced by cultural and societal dynamics of the time. The Roman mindset of the era was imbued with a fatalistic acceptance of natural disasters as manifestations of divine will or cosmic forces. As a result, there was a notable absence of organized efforts to mitigate the risks posed by Vesuvius or to prepare for the eventuality of a major eruption. Economic Importance Pompeii was a bustling commercial hub and a vital link in the Roman trade network, serving as a gateway to the Mediterranean and beyond. The city's economic significance meant that its inhabitants were reluctant to abandon their homes and businesses, even in the face of mounting volcanic activity. This attachment to material wealth and prosperity may have contributed to a sense of complacency among the populace, leading them to underestimate the severity of the impending disaster. Legacy and Remembrance Despite the tragic loss of life and devastation wrought by the eruption of Mount Vesuvius, the ruins of Pompeii have endured as a poignant testament to the resilience of the human spirit. Excavations of the site have provided invaluable insights into the daily life, 
architecture and culture of ancient Rome, offering a window into the past for future generations to explore and understand. Conclusion the destruction of Pompeii was the result of a complex interplay of geological, environmental, cultural, and socio-economic factors. While the eruption of Mount Vesuvius served as the immediate cause of the city's demise, deeper underlying issues such as lack of preparedness, societal attitudes, and economic interests played significant roles in shaping the course of events. As we continue to study and reflect on the tragedy of Pompeii, we are reminded of the fragility of human civilization in the face of nature's awesome power. 